Hello diamonds and welcome back to the supermarket simulator. It has been for me very long time since I last recorded because the first three episodes were recorded all at the same time and now well, I haven't even released anything for two weeks. So yeah, anyway, we are back. There has been no update on the game unfortunately, which I really hope will come soon because well, we need new stuff. We need fixes to the issues that people are having and yeah just to get it better. Anyway, as I'm kind of trying to understand what I did last time, as, as I can't really remember, I can see that I need to order a lot of stuff. So, oil, pasta, bread, well, pretty much everything. And yeah, we have our cashier here as well, which is nice. This table um, probably will move at some point. I don't like it here. Actually, can we take it right now? I'd rather put it somewhere here. Yeah, like this way. Can we? Yes. So this way it makes kind of more sense to have it here. Because, well, all the shoppers, they come this way. So the manager is just looking here. And then, like, the backing area is kind of available for everyone. Anyway, the light's on. So we know what we're doing. And let's see what we can order. It's a lot of stuff. Hmm, some things are more expensive. Okay, good to know. Anyway. Uh, tea and coffee, we can only take one each, because otherwise we are out of money immediately. Everything else, I mean, I can't take everything. Uh, so, okay. We took six products. Okay, so... Still more left to do. Another six. And what can we take? Oh, we can't take that much. <laughs> out of the money. <laughs> oh my. Ooh. That's painful. We'll start the day with only one dollar. Oh my. Okay. At least let's get this mess on the shelves. Let's see if I still remember how to use the game. <laughs> so easy to forget stuff. I'm also thinking about uh, making new series for the Echo. Because there's nothing really happening at the moment, so I'm not sure what we can do. There's like all the good service there. Well, not running really. Or they're just not really perfect for us. So yeah, I still feel that the most suitable server for me was uh, on Echo B and Hornets. But well, those are not coming back, at least not anytime soon, so. So yeah, nothing else. So I'm still thinking if I will make a single player. Maybe even try out some mods for the single player. Just to see what can be done. Ooh. Put more there. So yeah. So those are kind of my short-term plans. But yeah. Until then, well, I'll do at least one or two episodes here. And then uh, I'm also thinking if I should try out some other games. Because I've been playing a little bit uh, outside the recording sessions. Like trying out the uh, uh, recycling game. That I kind of got interested because Trey was playing it. But yeah, I'm full of milk. That's nice. So yeah. Plus, it has no expansion, which I haven't bought yet. So maybe we want to get that and investigate. Not sure. So yeah, many things to plan. And I'm not very good at planning. <laughs> But yeah, school is going well, happily. There's a lot of studying. So, pretty much Tuesdays, Wednesdays and Thursdays, I don't really have time. Especially if, if I work from the office. If I work from home, it's fine. But from the office, then impossible to do any recording or even to play by myself, so. So that's kind of 
a little bit sad. So it will impact my recording times, definitely. So, yeah. Anyway, we are pretty much finished with the stocking, so I definitely want to get the shop opened and things started. I know we are not fully stocked yet, but it's not the worst. So let's open it up. Good. And let's see. What do we need? Ah, here. A bill is obeyed. Okay, that's what we did last time. That's good. <laughs> to hire any, anyone else, we need to, well, pretty much do more sales ourselves, which also means that we need to buy extra cashier element of the register. For the restocker, we need to get the rack. We need uh, to expand the building enough. I mean, building has been expanded enough because we already have the door. But we need to expand the storage as well to get this access. It's much easier. So how much, how much actually is the growth? No, storage. Ooh, 800. We need to make somehow $800 to open up the storage. And I also want to buy the extra cash register, which is what, 500? Yes. So either the mirrored one or regular one, doesn't matter. But we definitely need this. And I also need to buy the small rack and get to level 15. So I think we have a lot of waiting left here. So those sales are seemingly very, very slow. <laughs> okay. So anyway, I need to wait until this day is over and then we can pretty much start seeing any other steps. So just give me a hot minute. Okay. So the last customer for the day has left. So we can pretty much close up for the day and let's see what the next morning brings us. So let's see. I mean, let's see also the stats. We had 36 customers, not that many. It's kind of a small number still. We did get quite a bit of store points and we made some of the profit. I had to buy a few extra things during the day because they were running low. But yeah, it's not too bad and balance is quite good. We can start looking into getting some other stuff very soon, I guess, at least. By the end of this episode, I want to have something like a storage room. So let's start. Okay, new prices, of course. So let's see, this is still good. Because I don't know what I changed and what I didn't. Ooh, we can do this for 50. Lovely. Do it this. <laughs> this is not low. Ah. It was nicely, really, really expensive yesterday. And today it's worth nothing. Okay, anything else that has really unique pricing? Mm, yeah, it's fine. We need to definitely buy more coffee and tea today. Those are really, really running low. Milk is still okay. We definitely need more eggs. Maybe a little bit more water as well. Okay, that's a lot of stuff. What can we take first? So let's take a few eggs. All those. Anything else we can... So we should take three of those, so it's very expensive. <laughs> but nothing we can do. Uh, one of those each. And let's take those in first. Yeah, I, I don't need more than one of those. But the other products I need loads. Okay, loading time. We still have some water left over, I guess. Ah, maybe not. Maybe not. Tea is good. I do like that we can put so many on one shelf. It saves a lot of space. It's very expensive pack. So 20 of those will cost like about $50. So, so yeah, not the cheapest thing. But of course we do sell at double price. So, 
at least <laughs> that is coming for us. It's a positive thing. Coffee, also expensive, but well, less than half in the box. About the same price per big box. So, yeah. Okay, that's, that's really a really small box. Anyway, that's not the problem. Yeah, eggs are really necessary. I think the egg prices are going up all over the world. At least here in Japan, they've been going up a lot. Last year, I think they raised... I can't even remember. It went up like, like 50 yen. So normal the six pack was like what 160, 170. Now it's over 200. So yeah, the prices go up. I wish we had this already implemented where the prices here would go the same way. So today we need bread. Pretty much those four. We might need to take one pasta as well. And maybe one egg. Let's see. So two of those, two of those, two of those, one of this, two of those, and one of this. And we can still buy it. Yoohoo. But we also need to pay all our rents. Right? Yes. And do we have any loans? I don't I think we didn't take any loans yet. Yeah, we didn't take yet. Which you might do in the near future, who knows? Because well, to do the expansion, we need a little bit financial inputs, and loans are very good for that. So when I was doing the first playthrough, then it was kind of good way to make it happen very quickly. Because once your shop is bigger, you definitely get more customers, and therefore you are starting to make more money. And a good thing to keep in mind. But well, at the moment we can still wait a little bit. It's not too much rush rush. So 12. Oh yeah. So much unpacking. We really need the stockers already. They're not too far off. I mean we're still at level 10 but yeah, just a few levels to do and we can start keeping stuff properly. Oh, actually we had a lot of sugar. It's just misleading a little bit. Okay, then we can. At least we don't need to buy su sugar anytime soon, so that's good. Those we might. Let's put the X down. And those are what, 8 packs? Okay, yeah, I usually buy 10 packs, and recently I noticed that there was one special variant in Life Supermarket that instead of uh, the regular uh, 10, they had actually 12. Really good deal. Same price, eggs were slightly smaller, but honestly, it was still more egg in general than with the regular 10 pack. But anyway, now that the shop is open, uh, we currently don't have enough to have second register, so I will let it run and monitor the stock. If I need to buy anything, I will buy, otherwise I will see you all at the end of the day. Our final customer of the day is still in the shop. I did buy a new register, which I've been using a little bit, just to get my count up. And yeah, there's just enough space so we could add it. And yeah, this guy is so slow at doing this. I wish we had upgrades in the later stage of the game, but we don't. Literally having four of them is still not comparable to one of the actual players. Anyway, the person has left, so let's close it down. And well, oh. feels like we need some type of shading on those because he shouldn't be on like this. It's just too much. Anyway, let's welcome to new day. So, today, 35 customers. Uh, no profit because I spent 500 on the extra stuff and supplies. We spent a lot as well. 
So yeah, compared to yesterday, we are down. So let's start new day. Ah, okay, and the prices are always changing, which is a problem. Ooh, yes, running low on oil as well. But well, we can sell it for six today, which is good. This is fine. Actually, I was thinking that maybe I should make it like at zero ending, so it's easier to use the card payments. And uh, this one will be 350 maybe. Okay, that's fine. It's still okay. Yeah, I don't trust uh, the signs, so that's why I always go over several times. Even if I shouldn't. So, as I said, let's finish with zero, easier, that's fine. Yep, yep, yep. And okay, now those prices are done. Need oil mainly and cheese. Oil and cheese are the main elements, and also cereal. So, oil, cheese, cereal, maybe a little bit bread, pasta. Uh, floor as well, and on this side, you can actually maybe get extra milk. Okay, it's quite expensive. We have a nice number left, so let's see. Come on, that's one thing why I don't like them. They they always are in front of the character. <laughs> So, got the breads, bread done, that's cheese, there's a lot of cheese that we need to sell. So I'm thinking that uh, for tomorrow, in the morning, I will spend, uh, I will take out the loan, so we can do the expansion to the business. So we get the storage room, storage shelves, and well, literally start uh, getting things ready so we don't need to worry about the uh, stocking anymore and also maybe get one more license and some storage so I need to check the prices for everything for that because yeah then we need to pay quite a lot for a few days until we get far enough so yeah it's kind of a big thing to do not sure if you are ready, to be honest. But uh, you have to. You want to get somewhere, so that's the only way. Okay, that's done. Last piece. Ah, more oil. More oil. Okay. Everything is done, so. We can open the shop again. Lights on, so it's nicer. And I think today I will try to do the work myself as well. So at least we can get the numbers higher. Before we do that, we need to pay the bills. Only five dollars left. That's not good. And yeah. So we are at 304. We still need plenty more. And yeah, that's actually quite expensive to have the restocker. But at the same time, we have four levels to go, so not too bad. Cross-wise, if you want to expand the shop, 750, 1300. So minimum 2000 for the expansion. License will be 400, 550, 550. It's quite expensive. But I think we need to do it to get somewhere. So tomorrow morning, we take the new licenses and stuff and get running so let's see how it goes yeah again waiting for the last two customers to finish so just during the day by the end side I was trying to do some calculations on on the loan that we want to take in the morning and I feel that we cannot fulfill all the requirements that I was wanting to so we can make only one expansion one 
or two licenses, few of the storage, like all the shelves and stuff, and that's all. So let's get to the morning and see how this day was. So 36 customers again, that's all good. We made a little bit profit, which is good. So let's see, of course, we are losing a lot of money with different prices. This has gone down, so it's 5.6, fine. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Yeah, good. I'll do. That's a little bit too much <laughs> to ask, I guess. 2.8. Put this. Yeah, it's kind of okay ish, I guess. Need to buy a lot of stuff again. Like usual. No surprises here. So yeah, just before we even do anything else. So what we need? Sugar. Definitely sugar, law, oil. And coffee. So let's do. Okay. Law. Sugar. Oil. Coffee. Milk. Yes. Okay. We'll do for the morning. After that, we will look into the loan right away. Because I want to make sure that we have those things in stock. Oh, we need water as well. Okay. If we need water as well, then we need to get water. Yeah. yeah. I wish we had, like, better system available. They could have the restockers for the bringing stuff in already. It is planned, as I understand from the messages that the dev has shown on this course. But when exactly it will happen, it, no one really knows. So, just have to wait, I guess. Okay, milk is done. Sugar. Sweetness on our shelves. Nice. So yeah, I'm really looking forward for next update because it should bring us some good things. I also know that they are planning to have their thieves, which I'm not really big fan of because well, my concentration is quite bad. And I don't want to lose a lot of money in game or go bankrupt just because I don't notice something very quickly. Or if they make it kind of similar to what, uh, uh, what was the game name? It's the parking lot management. Like if they, uh, like they did, then I don't find it very attractive. Anyway, before we even start the day, we need to do a few extra steps. So, first of all, bills, pay, pay, then bank. So we can only change the amount of days for the loan. So I think 10 days is kind of fine. It's not too much extra money that we have to pay. And I'm thinking about taking maybe both, but at least the bigger one. We can pay back early if, if we can, which is good. That would take the second loan as well. It's good. Now, management, we need extra license. Initially, we, I will take just one. So we can get those and we need to grow the space a little bit. Again, I'm not sure if we want to go any further right away. So from the marketplace, all the new items. We should take what, three each. This one, we need two more. Wow, that's how the money goes. And we need two shelves, I guess. And if we need any fridge unit, then we can take those as well. So. Ah, we need definitely extra lights for that. Okay, so 
Now let's get started with moving everything around again. I know the window looks kind of nice and stuff, but... But we don't really want to use... That. Ah, it doesn't fit this way, so... We need to put different ways. And yeah, we need the snapping tool for all the shelves. This can stay there, I guess. Yeah, we start the new shelves on this corner. And I also wish that our grabbing distance would be a little bit bigger. At the moment it's a little bit too low. So. So pasta comes on that shelf. Peanut butter can come to this shelf. All the prices had to set as well, of course. This is more spaghetti. I think there was another pasta. I mean, the other pasta we already have on our shelves, right? Yeah, over, over, over there. Yeah, this one. This other pasta, so. It's kind of close, so not too bad. Oils, then we should put opposite ways as well, I guess. I mean, at one point in the future, we'll, of course, need to change them to put things more logically. But, well, for the time being. Because it takes a lot of time to move things around and set them up, so... But yeah. Okay, light is there. Light on. Nice. I mean, it's not straight. Again, we need some type of grade system to make it easier for us. So like when you have the light in your hands, it would be nice if it showed like the grid where the other lights are. I mean, this light is obviously wrong, but, but they, it would be very useful if you could actually see it. But yeah, we don't have such thing. Or like uh, the Google Sheets has some alignment tools. It should show the similar way. This is new product. I have to put it down. I think we need one more shelf, right? Yeah, for the salt. And what else do we have? The other floor. So I need one more shelf. So I think we need to put this one. Like this. And to prepare longer lines. One more shelf. Still happy to have some money, so not totally bankrupt, but well, we don't really have much either, so nothing to be to be really proud of. So yeah, quick stocking, and after that we will do one more day, and then I will conclude the video for the day. So next week I will need to record the uh, next one. Hopefully by that time we have some updates or at least more information about when it will come out. So we've been waiting like since 1st of April or so. It's a really long time. So pretty much two months by now, so yeah. else this one more okay very small boxes so if you inside there no? and empty <laughs> so quick the peanut butter this one we actually have a lot in one box which is good as much rice is okay not the best, but okay. Okay. Done. Nice. So now all the prices. So we can put this to seven. Very good. Salt is cheap, so it's two thirty. 
peanut butter is a bit more expensive, so 560. Yes, I go with the market price because who cares? This again, seven. Oil, what we can do, what's 580. This one is 680. And this one is all stuff, all is checked. Okay, looks nice. But let's open the shop. All looks good. Nice. And the people can then come to different aisles nicely. I think it looks good. And yeah, I would definitely want to do some sales myself. Just to increase my numbers. What is the current number? We can quickly check. The current number is 321. Not bad. Ooh, and you already people are buying the new stuff. Nice. But of course, taking also a lot of tea and stuff. One dollar back. Okay, that's nice. So yeah, I will quickly sell everything that we can and well then we can see how good the day was, get the daily totals and then leave the video for the day. I just ran into some issues. We ran out of water. Because when people bought a lot and I did not notice, we actually need coffee as well, but it's already time to end the day, so yeah. So I did notice one of the notifications for the water, unfortunately. So not the perfect day, but not the worst. So the sales have been quite decent. And yeah, all the checkouts are full. Okay, here you go. Okay, it's not full anymore. Give me your cards. Let's empty it out. There we go. <laughs> but yeah, the that line now does get too long just because, well, he's too slow. He needs to speed up a lot. And yeah, we need some type of balancing that if you have two registers open, then people would go between those if one is taking too long. Like in real life, people do jump the queues. But yeah, here it's seemingly that one cashier is super busy, other one is just sleeping all day. So not really realistic at all. Especially if you only have like two registers and uh, people need to walk past off the first one anyways. <laughs> yeah, well, things are as they are. This time I'm not even closing it because there's no real point. And this lady will be our last customer for this video it seems. So please, quickly, if your manager is monitoring you, then maybe there's something going on. <laughs> anyway, we are now closed for the day. So let's see how well or badly we did. So yeah, one product was not found, the water that I mentioned. We actually spent a lot of money. We spent 1800 on upgrades. Then extra 800 on supplies. So yeah, a lot. But our income is now like $150 more than the day before. So I think it's quite good. Some prices have changed. But before we even do any prices, which I will do beginning of the next video, I guess. Let's see how, how all the bills are. This one I could literally pay off early. It would be good makes life a lot easier so everything is paid so yeah this one we need to kind of make 1880 extra dollars and yeah i need to buy a lot of more stuff before we can start the day but yeah i will leave today's video right here it has been quite interesting to get it expanded and yeah loans are very useful they are kind of short term but they do work. So yeah, let's see how we can get it much better next time. So, so we'll see you then. Anyway, thank you for watching again. Bye.